to the channel and I hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. This lab is just recently updated so it is a new solution for the lab and there are some changes in the UI so I will talk about that as well. So first of all just me log with your credentials and once done with that just me come back over here and just me search for the Vertex AI. Then you will come back to this page over here. Now here we have to just me search for the workbench. You can see this workbench over here inside this notebook. Just me click over here and once you click over here you will come back to this page. Then just me click on this open Jupyter lab and Jupyter notebook is already created for you. Just me click over there and the Jupyter notebook will launch for you like this way. Okay. Now if you just me check we are not able to see any file over here. So if you also face this kind of issue don't worry. Just me come back to your notebook. Just me click on the checkbox and then just me click on this reset button over here. Just me click once, wait for a couple of seconds and it will reload. You can see it's now reloading. So just me wait now. So I can ask you something from you? Really? Now I will ask you and if you don't believe it, if you don't believe it, but if you don't believe it, then we will do it. And it's now active. Now if you just me come back over here and if you just me refresh the page, you are able to find the file. If you are not able to find it, don't worry. You can just me close that tab. Okay. And again click on the open Jupyter lab. Like this way. Okay. Now just me wait and watch. And finally, we are able to see all these files over here. Now just me click on this file name over here like this way. Now if you are using a Jupyter notebook for the first time, so for running a shell or we can say command, you can just me click on this play button or you can just me hit shift and enter. Just make sure that your kernel must be python3 like this way. Just me click over here and from here just me choose python3. Click on this select button over here like this way. Just me make sure that it should be ideal. If it connecting, busy, disconnecting, at that time we have to just me wait. So just me wait until our kernel status show as ideal. So now just me wait and watch. So as you can see now the kernel shutter is showing as a ideal. Now what you do just me scroll down over here and from here you can see this particular shell. So just me hit shift and enter till end over here like this way. Okay now just me wait until this thing is showing as a ideal. And it's finally done. Now if you just come back over here and click on the check my progress for this particular task, you will get a score without any issue. And if the score is not updated for this particular task, don't worry. Just me wait for a couple of seconds and you will get a full score over here for sure. So just me wait and watch. And as you can see, it's done. And in this way, we have to complete this lab. If you still have any doubts, please do let me in the comment section. Thanks for watching and have a good day guys. So please sub sub kar sara kabar sub kar kar aaye sara sara kab whatever I want to reach one million likes.